Hey, what's going on guys, Pogue here, and welcome to my Minecraft Let's Play. This is episode number 43, and in today's episode, we are going to be going down to the mineshaft and collecting the diamonds that I decided not to take back in the time, uh, because I was waiting to get this beautiful Fortune 3 pickaxe. So we are going to be going down to this awesome mineshaft tower, well, inside the mineshaft tower, and then down this beautiful elevator water fountain thing. And we should then get down to here and there we are so there should be a diamond here somewhere okay uh, another thing I have to do of course in today's episode maybe is to also fix up this place so that it kind of you know looks complete because I don't like it when it's all like that right now so the roof and all that maybe I'll work on that as well uh, but yeah, so this is where it is. Let's go ahead and actually get rid of the map because it's kind of on the way uh, But here we go. So this is a silk touch one pickaxe. So we're gonna go ahead and do this real quick and Off we go. So we should have found it some diamonds here where I decided not to take so we're just gonna go here and um, Hope that the diamonds are still there and we're gonna use the fortune pickaxe and see how many we'll get so let me know guys how many diamonds you think I'll be getting at the end of this episode. But me personally, I'm not really seeing any diamonds here. I might have mined it and totally forgot because it seems like I'm... Oh, no, I haven't forgot. Okay, it's right here. So there's uh, there's two. So how many do you think? I'm going to say we're going to have four. What? From two guys, I just got five. There we go. So we have 11 diamonds, guys. That is great. So I'm not really sure uh, which ones I haven't, like, checked. So I don't think this one had anything. So I'm going to go back to this one because I think this one definitely might have it. So we'll just go back this one. And if it's not, then it is what it is. How did I forget the siren here, though? That's my question. Uh, let's use the fortune for the redstone actually why not never dig the block you guys are standing on of course and let's get this experience levels as well gotta be careful this might take me right to a lava there we go okay now I gotta get out of here and figure out how to go back to where I had to be so we're just gonna make the jump. And I think, yes, there is diamonds here and I picked the right one, so that's great. So we're gonna go ahead and take this diamond. So far we have 11. My my guessing is we're gonna have 30 diamonds at the end of this episode, which would be amazing if that's the case. But yeah, so here we go. Let's go ahead and get all this. Fortune pickaxe, guys, is amazing. Look at this. You know what, we might have way more than 30. We might hit 40 if it goes this way. Let me just quickly look around it, of course. And I think this is the one I was going, so we're just gonna go this way. Oh yeah, there's even more diamonds right there. So let's go ahead and get these. I'm really happy, guys, that I waited till now to go ahead and collect these. And there we go, so we have 32 diamonds, you guys, so far. Just double check. Oh my god. I kind of almost left this diamond here to disappear. And I think that was three pieces. How lucky am I to even look back? Oh my god, I missed more iron. How do I do this? It's like I need to like double check every time like I'm done strip mining. Should I just run back to the same place and see make sure I got everything? Alright, so I did have lights there. Okay. Alright, so for this one all I have to do is go from this one and then come back to the next one. So that's what I have to do. And then we should completely get all the diamonds that are currently around here. So let's just keep going. It's definitely awesome that I have my bucket of water with me. So in case something were to happen, I should be just fine. But yeah, guys, we might even hit like 64 diamonds. I hope that's the case, but we'll find out soon enough. But I was just guessing like 30, but wow. This is just amazing. The amount of 
you know, diamonds we get with a fortune pickaxe is amazing. And we are about to find out. So let's go ahead and get this. And there we go. Oh my god, I almost missed this. 53, guys. Yeah, we're definitely going to get 64. And I had to go back. We just came from here. So I have to go back this one. This is where the diamonds are. And... I just put this because I don't want to do anything risky with all these diamonds in my inventory. Because this is very, 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 very important. Like, it's... I've been waiting to have this much diamonds for a very, very long time. And to go back up there with like 64 diamonds because of this beautiful Fortune 3 pickaxe, it is just amazing. But I'm not seeing any diamonds, that's the thing. So, what happened? The question is... Um, did I by an accident just pass the diamonds, guys? Is this the one? It should be. Um, wait. I thought there should be diamonds here. Because I kind of marked it. Gotta make sure I didn't pass it. Because if I did, that's a big fail. Uh, nothing here. Everything seems fine here. Interesting. What happened to the diamonds that I thought are here? Because I kind of marked it. Have I maybe marked it because I kind of saw it from here? Like it might have been there. Well, I mean, I still have more diamonds than I thought of having but we'll still go back to this one maybe I might have marked it wrong so we'll just go back using this route to see if there will be any difference I do like how the strip mine isn't really super super long like it is long but it's not so long that you get tired of it uh, by, by like walking across but definitely, I think this is it. This is all the diamonds that I left back in the time. It's very nice to finally collect it, especially collect it with the Fortune 3 pickaxe. This is what I've been waiting on for for some time. So it's definitely very nice. So let's go ahead and get this. And this is how it's all going to be. So we have already the cobblestones around here. So we're just going to go ahead and get all this so I can kind of place the cobblestones okay so we got this that would go just like this okay and then we're gonna have torches right there torch right here this one has been mined now I do need to go get some cobblestone I'm also gonna go ahead and put these diamonds away because the last thing I need is to lose them so we're going to go ahead and do that as well. And everything looking good, which is nice. And the diamonds would be simply in this awesome chest. And we have 62 diamonds. So if I wanted to, I could technically go ahead and create myself some diamond armor, which would be nice. Okay, so we're going to take slabs, all this. Um, going to take all this as well, all that too. And then we'll kind of store some of these inside of the um, inside of the chests around there in the mine shaft because it's gonna come in handy sooner or later. So why not? Let's hope safely everything is gonna be nice. I did put the diamonds away. That's a good thing. And imagine if this lava somehow like I'm going down and I go through the glass into the lava somehow, like that would be horrible. Like, if it were to happen. Okay, uh, cobblestone time. It's gonna go simply like this. Very, very simple. I think this is the look I was going for. 
and there we go got this one already happening all of this will go like that and there we go so all I have to do is put that torch right there and these ones I could technically do them right now so let's go ahead and do it why not okay this one of course and then like this and yeah that's about it for this one so let's go ahead and do that now for this in the other hand I still have to go and do this so that it's gonna be similar to that one Go ahead and get that. I also want to be making sure that I don't accidentally use the fortune pickaxe because uh, since I don't have multiple fortune pickaxes, I have to be very careful with this one because this took a long time to get. All right, so let's go ahead and place all this cobblestone on the ceiling, sides, edges thing. And then all we have to do is start placing the smooth stone slabs. So let's go ahead and do that. Not like that. I don't want to waste it. So let's go ahead and collect that back simply. And let's go ahead and put that back one more time. Everything looking great. And all right. So the ceiling is all done. Now all I have to do is work on the floor. Now with the floor, I do have to be very careful so that I don't accidentally fall into lava. Because I don't want to lose any of my tools, especially the Fortune 3 that took a long time to get. Let's go ahead and do this. Not really sure what's here. I might have found something like a coal or iron or redstone or lapis. I don't know. Might have found something and that's why I blocked it, but obviously not completely. All right, so then we take the smooth stone slabs and then we're just gonna go like this very easily all the way till the end. And then we'll just obviously put the cobblestone and work on the walls as well. So there we go. And then we'll just go ahead and put all of this right in here. And then again, it's nice to have all the uh, chests around here so I can just put these materials here so that I don't have to ever you know, worry much about not having materials to complete this uh, this place. So this one has been obviously mined. Uh, since I have some more, why not to make this even longer a little bit? Let's just do this. And imagine if I actually find diamonds doing this, you guys. That's going to be amazing. If I actually find diamonds doing this. Okay. Unfortunately, I didn't find any diamonds, but it would have been nice if I did. Okay. Let's just... What is that sound? It sounded like it came from above. Alright, so that's going to be here. And then we're going to put this there, this there, put a nice torch, of course. Same for this one. Nice cobblestone torch. It's nice to have this obviously completed. Because then, if I ever have to mine, because this left side, guys, has been very lucky for me. That's where I found most of the stuff. So it's like I mainly want to actually explore that side than this side, but the, than the right side, let's say. But of course, I don't want to leave the right side unexplored because who knows, maybe when I mine around here, I'll actually find more diamonds. Okay, so what I have to do now is I'll just go ahead and use cobblestone to just block this. Just like that. And then I'll go ahead and take this. And then... Go ahead and put the torch there, so deal with that. 
Okay, and then I'll just have to now work on the ceiling and the floor, of course. So let's go ahead and get all this. Again, gotta be very, very careful so I don't fall into anything. Especially lava, but I don't hear any lava, so we should be just fine. Okay, let's go ahead and do this. There we go. Oh, I have to actually get this. There we go. And then we go ahead and put this right here. And then all I have to do is put the cobblestone like this, of course. And then we have to work on the ceiling. And we are almost done with the floor and the ceiling. And then all I have to do is kind of replace the rest with the stone bricks. There we go. Cobblestone goes all across here. And then here. Then we're just going to use the smooth stone slabs. And oh my god, this is going to look really, really nice. Okay, let's go ahead and do this. Awesome. All right. There we have it, guys. So this is kind of what it looks like right now. So all we have to do now is just kind of replace these with the stone bricks. So let's go ahead and get rid of all this so that I can actually replace it. Shouldn't take much time, which is a good thing. Let's go ahead and get that. And then we're gonna go ahead and try to get this one, of course. Just like that. Then we have the shovel to get rid of the dirt. There we have it. Gotta be making sure that I don't accidentally place anything. And oh! Look at that, I found emerald. Good that I have the fortune pickaxe with me, but it still gave me just one. Okay, that is what it is. All right, so I did have some of these right here. So let's go ahead and use that, why not? So how this is gonna go is of course, very similar to the other ones. All I have to do is just place the stone bricks, I think it's called of course, just like this. Okay. And it's kind of gonna do all the rest of the look on its own which is the most important part so it's just gonna go like this and then we're gonna have this one right here just like this and then i can just simply create some more i think from here maybe yes okay let's go ahead and do that why not we'll have like this many we'll get the job done of course and there we go so this is how it's gonna be and now all I have to do is uh, repeat the process on this side very simple let's go ahead and get these and then oh no gotta play around with this now okay I was just one piece okay I was just uh, thinking it's gonna be a lot more than that so that's why I used the torch otherwise I could have just used the shovel okay here we go gotta be again very careful so I don't end up uh, placing anything in the wrong place because that might make me mine the wrong area, which is not going to be a good thing. Because what if I miss the diamonds that I was supposed to find in that place? Okay, so there we go. Got all of these. And then let's start off with this. So obviously it's going to be like this. Okay. And then it's going to be like that. And it's just going to be repeating the same process over and over again until we are fully completed with these and do I have enough I might have just enough you guys look at that okay so there we go I did go ahead and completed this mineshaft part now I was actually thinking what if I did this to just kind of make it cooler so if I just took these and then I place them like this, let's just leave it like this. I find it that it looks much nicer. It's kind of like a dead end. And it, it kind of looks very similar to the entire design of this uh, mine shaft. But yeah, guys, so this is what it looks like. I do hope that you guys enjoyed today's episode. If you are new to the channel, please consider subscribing. Follow me on Instagram. The link is in the description. That being said, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.